If you've ever had to move individual posts or pages from one website to another, then you know it can be time consuming and pretty tedious, but not anymore. In this video, you'll learn how to do just that, and we're going to see if we can do it in record time. Hi, I'm Christine with Thrive Themes. If you haven't subscribed to our channel yet, here is your friendly reminder to do so, and if you ring the bell, you'll be notified when we publish new videos. So the ability to quickly export and import individual post or page content might be handy if you have a major website renovation project. But even if you're not in the middle of a project, you might still need to copy content to use as a template, or maybe you want to get in the habit of exporting your finished pages and posts just to have them as a backup. Because even if you write all of your posts in a word processor before bringing them into WordPress, what's nice about exporting from Thrive Architect is that it retains all of the formatting and all of the images. So it's just really nice to have a properly formatted backup in your own archives that's easy to access. Now, just to make things extra fun, I thought we would time this process and see just how fast it is to export a post from one site and import it into another. Now, of course, it is super easy to just copy and paste a wall of text, but when you have a page that looks like this, that has content boxes and icons, and it also has images, and it also uses blocks, recreating this would take a lot of time. So let's use the export import content feature in Thrive Architect to see just how easy it is. Now, before we get started, I want to mention that we're only going to be exporting the content portion of this page. Remember this page has a lot of different parts. There's a header, there's a top section, there's a sidebar, and down at the bottom of the page, we also have a bottom section and a footer. So we're only going to export this content section because the other sections are part of our website's theme. Our new site has a different theme and it also has different colors. So you'll see that the colors and fonts automatically update to match the styling that has been set in the new website. All right, so let's get started. Let's click Edit with Thrive and let's open this page in Thrive Architect. Okay, so let's start the clock. To export this page, I'll go to the settings icon, then I'll go to export content. Let's give this a name. Then I'll click download file. Okay, this is downloading to my computer. Now let's hop over to our other website. I'll go ahead and create a new post. give this a title. Okay, let's go ahead and choose a category. Let's add a tag. We'll set a featured image. And let's launch Thrive Architect. Okay, so again, I'll go to the settings icon, then I'll click import content, then I'll upload my file. Okay, I'll make sure it's selected, then I'll click import. And here we are, I think we're done. And as you can see, this post inherited the fonts and also the colors for our new website's theme. All right, so how did we do time-wise? That was a lot faster than recreating all of this manually, right? So that was how to use the export and import content feature in Thrive Architect. You can get Thrive Architect and the rest of our tools when you purchase Thrive Suite. Click the link in the description to learn more. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.